Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to connect a Squarespace domain to Hostinger in 2024. So today I'll walk you through the step-by-step -step guide or tutorial on how to connect your Squarespace domain. Of course, this will allow you to or your or your custom domain or this will allow your custom domain to point to point to your Hostinger website specifically. So make sure to stick by and let's get started before we start with this video make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have full experience first you'll need to go and open a browser here i'm using brave for you you can use this you want once you open that browser basically just go to the crl section here make sure to go in both squarespace.com and even open a new tab go to host tinger Dot com go to them both of course make sure to log in in your both accounts and hosting if you have an account as you can see you can use google facebook or github and if you don't have an account of course make sure to go and create an account and you should be uh, create an account on it for me here on squarespace i'm already like logged in so i'll just go here and access my dashboard right away so as you can see i have both i'm logged in into both accounts so what should we do first of all first of all go to your squarespace and check if your domain is still uh, there as you can see for me i have no domains so if you have no domains first of all if you want to transfer instead of connect like uh, if you're still gonna use it on squarespace maybe in the future or something like that you're just trying something and you still don't have a domain yet just get your domain here and your squarespace and you should be good to go as an example by clicking on get a domain enter the domain that you want to get as an example maybe i'll just type here omics maybe tester as example.com see if this domain is available as you can see the first one is available i'll just go here and click on that as you can see you can add another domains like .org.net with this.com but for me i don't want to i'll just go and click here and click on continue to check out right away once I click on that, as you can see, the registration term, so ensure domain ownership and look in the current price of the number of years selected by choosing multi-year term. So you can see the domain, how many years do you want to, uh, do you want to have it? As you can see, one year, you'll pay $12. If you add any years, it will add $20. So you'll get a discount for just the first year, $8. Even if you get 10 years, you'll, no, you'll not get any other discounts. As an example, so 20 uh Multiplied per 10 is 200, as you can see, and it's a dollar discount. So if you can click on save and continue, depending on the number of years that you enter, fill up your registration information, address information, payment information, pay for it, and you should be good to go. So once you get it, as an example, you'll just find this here, just refresh this, and you'll find it on your domains. So, but if you already have a domain and you just want to transfer it, not just connect it to Hostinger, you can simply go and click on transfer domain here, Enter the domain that you want to transfer. Let's say, for example, the one that we just tried to get. So, Omex Tester, it's all also already showed there. As you can see, for me, it will show me that isn't registered yet. But for you, they will show you like the instructions on how to transfer it to whatever you want. Other than that, if you want to just connect it to Hostinger, if you already have it, of course, just go to your Hostinger. If you go to your Hostinger here and go to domains, as an example here, you'll find two options. Find the domain. As an example, to buy, let's say, example, as we said, if you want to just transfer it uh, or you still don't have it and you just transfer it, let's tr see here. Uh, so, Omex Tester, as an example, let's see how much does it cost in here. So, I'll just go here and click on search. As an example, it costs much, much less than Squarespace. So, if you still didn't get it, make sure to get it on Hostinger as it seems, just $5 per year and only for two years plus term. So, for example, if you want to get more years, for example, like three years, it will be uh, like just $5. If you want to just get for one year, it's going to be $8. So, depending on whatever you want, as an example, and you'll even get a free domain privacy protection included. You can choose the payments method after that and etc. So, other than that, if you already own it like here, like, I don't know, you have your... Uh, 10 years maybe you got it like maybe three years ago and etc you would just want to connect it to a hostinger website or something like that you can simply go here and click on transfer once you click on transfer as you can see here uh, go and click on transfer domain to hostinger once you do so here you'll have to enter a domain for transfer as example which is going to be omics like tester.com normally if i enter that 
they will tell me that uh, yeah it gets a domain because it's already there so i'll type i'll try to type a domain that's already existed i guess this one already existed so yeah as you can see as you can see so domain locked uh this domain is locked so i'll just look for another one what about like this one so this should not be locked Oh, it's uh, yeah i i even like i did not renew it so i don't think i have access to it what's about like uh tester.com let's see if this is uh so the requirements is not met basically if it's yours as an example it's locked you'll find that uh, you'll be able to click in here and see how to unlock it basically so make sure to remove this transfer lock wherever you have it uh you can find instructions in some popular register right here as an example like on a lot of things in here so if it's not locked as you can see and the 60 days passed since the registration or transfer you'll be able to uh, simply just transfer or connect it here to your or transfer it here to your uh, hosting right away as you can see the price includes domain renewal after the successful transfer your domain expiration date will be an example until 2026 uh, instead of 2020 uh, like maybe five because renewal maybe one year maybe probably i'm not very sure of that and yeah so once you remove the lock just click on check again then it will get you into the instructions on how to uh, transfer it basically transferation will they will provide you with some dns records you'll have to go to squarespace uh, go to the domain click on manage dns records go and update those dns records with the one that they give you on hostinger uh, save everything and then you can simply just verify uh, come back here you'll find the verify option click on it and if you change dns records it may take uh, from you like some 12 hours even uh, to get it verified once you verify it you can set primary domain in hostinger then you can test the connection by going to that uh, like domain and check if the website that you have on hostinger is there if you have it that's going to be it for you today thank you for watching and goodbye you're good to go